Hi fans of high quality entertainment. Today I bought some used movies and CDs from Chumley's in Belleville, Ontario. A great place to buy. Uh, I think their main thing is gaming. They have all kinds of games. It's uh, a fairly small store, but they have a lot of games and CDs and movies. If you're in the Belleville, Ontario area, I highly recommend it because you can get some really good and, and rare videos and CDs too, as I will show you. Now, uh, I'm going to ask for Molly's permission first. So if, if this isn't part of the video, then she said, no, Larry. But she sent me a Valentine's card today. And so I thought it would open up and read it. Happy Valentine's Day. Oh. I found love when I found you. No money. <laughs> uh, at least when I was a kid, you know, you wouldn't even read the, you, you'd pretend you re read the card, you're just looking, hoping there's some money in there. Nowadays, I just sometimes hope there's money in there. Oh, I can't read this. The thrill of your kisses. Thank you, thank you very much. The warmth of your touch. The close, tender feelings I've longed for so much. I'm taking this seriously, sorry. I'm gonna take this seriously. The, thr the thrill of your kisses, the warmth of your touch, the close, tender feelings, I've longed for so much. And then she wrote, my love. And then it continues. A passion for life that makes each day seem new. These things I discovered the day I found you. Oh, happy Valentine's Day. Thank you. Thank you very much. I'm into Elvis Presley lately. Thank you, thank you very much. My forever valentine and love of my life. Good time. So romantic with the return on the water or shower. The My forever valentine and love of my life. I love you more than I can describe. And with every day it grows stronger. You have the biggest heart of anyone I have ever met. She's only met three or four people in her life. Thank you for sharing it with me forever, Mom. Thank you. I'm not going to cry. Okay, let's check out these movies and CDs. Yeah. So I bought three movies. Two are on Blu-ray and one is a DVD. I prefer Blu-ray. I'm pretty picky. But I thought... I would buy this. It was only, well, it was $7.99. DVD, Rush, Time, Stand Still. It's regarding their, their final tour. I had, I had the, uh, the, take two. First up on DVD, $7.99. Rush, Time Stand Still. It's, I think it's like a documentary on their final tour, sadly, and uh, about their fans and everything. And so that'll be an interesting watch. The story of a band, its fans, and their 40-year relationship. Now, I bought this for, of course, me and Molly, because both of us are huge Martin Short fans, and we also both really like Steve, Steve Martin. Uh, 
his first movie, The Jerk, is, is hilarious. Um, but this movie, I don't think Molly's ever seen it, and I've never seen it. Do you know what it is? Three Amigos. Let me know in the comments section, along with the other stuff I'm showing you, what you, if you have seen this, is it a comedy classic like I've read? I, I think when it came out, <clears throat> when it came out, of course, uh, the critics weren't too kind to it, but I think it's grown in stature over the years, and of course, uh, Chevy Chase is in it too, with Steve Martin and Martin Short, one of the greatest, he's one of my absolute favorite comedians, uh, along with Christopher Guest and Andy Kaufman and John Candy, of course. I could spend a whole video just talking about comedy. But back to the final Blu-ray. It's music related. Oh, and this this uh, this one was seven ninety nine. This one was nine ninety nine on Blu-ray. I've never seen it before. It looks interesting. Good to see you, Alice Cooper, with his original band, live nineteen seventy three, the Billion Dollar Babies tour. I love early Alice Cooper. I never really... I did. I like some of his solo career. But for the most part, it's... It's the early albums that I love. Comes with a little booklet. Hello, hooray. As you know, I've started a free scanning business. If you want anything scanned that I show you, just send me an email and I will scan it for you. I'm just joking. It's a joke. It's a running gag on my channel. <laughs> People seriously take that seriously. People have written to me. I'll take a scan of that booklet. Okay, here we go to the CDs. And uh, more than one of you have asked me to do a, you know, what I have for Van Morrison on CD and do a review. And I actually attempted it, and then I'm going through the CDs, and I realized I don't know all of the CDs well enough to do a proper review. I'm, I've focused on certain CDs and played them a lot, and then the other ones I have kind of haven't listened to enough. And it's just time related. And plus, you know, wanting to listen to other music too. But this is what I have so far of Van Morrison. Then I'll show you the three CDs I just got today. Of course, Molly got me this. TB Sheets. Sort of a, a greatest hits CD. Them, of course, his band that he was in in the 60s. Really good uh, three, three CD set. The original uh, recorded in concert, It's Too Late to Stop Now. And the uh, expanded version with, with volumes 2, 3, 4, and a DVD. So I'm, I'm just quickly showing you these. I'm blow, blowing your mind. I've already shown these in past videos. Of course, this is where it all started for me. Astral Weeks, of course, Moon Dance is awesome. Uh, Van Morrison, his band in the Street Choir is really good, really, really good. Into the Music, I love. Common One is great. Beautiful Vision, I need to play more. I think this is the one that has three instrumentals in it, so I haven't really focus too much on them. Inarticulate Speech of the Heart is great. I've enjoyed that. I love this one, Enlightenment. And the one Molly bought me, Magic Time, possibly one of my favorites after Astral Weeks. 
The Prophet Speaks, which I have I think I've listened to it once. <laughs> his, his later stuff, and then Three Chords of the Truth. The last time I heard this, it was okay. But uh, I need, you know, I'm going to give it more of a chance and listen to it more. But the CDs I got, $4.99 each. So let me know in the comment section. And everything I show you, I, I really appreciate the feedback. Thank you. Van Morrison, back on top. Ooh, nice. Different CD label. And looks like it just comes with the lyrics. Some photos to scan for everybody. Lyrics. So yeah, out of these three CDs of Van Morrison, I'd really appreciate you Van Morrison fans out there letting me know which ones, which one you like the best and what you think of them. The Healing Game. I know there's, I think there's an expanded version that came out, uh, but I just, I just like the original for the most part, the, except for the Beatles. I like the original albums and, you know, bonus cuts and everything and demos and whatever. Uh, I'm not as interested in usually. Another nice booklet. Comes with the lyrics. Very nice. And Van Morrison Days Like This. All of these were four ninety-nine. It'd be funny I look at the CD and it's all scratched up, but they're always in excellent condition. Basically the same for all of these CDs, just the lyrics and yeah, just the lyrics, which is fine. I won't complain. Would have been nice to have a picture or two in it though. <laughs> I forgot to put the CD back in, back on top. That's what she said. All right. And then I also bought four different CDs from four different artists. This is the exciting part of the video. I build up the suspense, sus, sus, suspense. I never say suspense very much, as you can tell. Here we go. I had this on CD for years and years and years. And I was hoping that it would come out again, you know, remastered or whatever. And it never did. But it's fine. I'm sure it's going to sound great. I'm just, sometimes I get a bit too picky. This was $5.99. Always really loved this band. The Cure. Staring at the Sea, the singles. And I've said this more than once, that in the uh, 80s and, you know, 90s, they made some of the best, most entertaining original videos. I know there is uh, another updated one but I don't think it has all of the songs that are on this. But uh, Killing an Arab, 
10, 15 Saturday night. Boys don't cry, I love that. My favorites on this would be A Forest, Play for Today, The Love Cats, In Between Days, cl and Close to Me. And the one that I never used to like was, I think it was, I think it was The Walk, but I'm, I'm sure I'll like it more now because I've matured. This I had. I, don't, I think I did have it on CD. You know, when this came out, I think I, I bought it on CD and then through the years, I just never listened to it anymore. But it, I really enjoyed this, so I wanted to get it again. You're going to be kind of surprised. Larry likes this band. At least this album I do. Oh, live through this. I especially love Violet, Miss World. See, some of the oh, dull parts I love. Some of these I don't remember, though. And my favorite is Rockstar, the final track. Hearts for Valentine's Day. Two more. Of course, one of my all-time favorite bands, as some of you know. This isn't regarded as one of their best albums I've, I've read, but you know, of course there are going to be fans out there, oh it's great, it's great. I'm sure it's not bad. It is Yes Talk. What a terrible album cover though, you know, compared to especially uh, Fragile or uh, even, well, Close to the Edge and almost in the album. So, you Yes fans out there, let me know. I, I've i played, I have Union, and I believe this is better than Union because I haven't been able to, to get into Union much. and the grand finale. As some of you know, I did a reaction video recently. It's had, uh, it's, it's still getting, you know, a few comments every day and good views. Thank you, thank you very much. That's right, the essential Elvis Presley. I was actually looking for uh, DVDs or Blu-rays of him in concert, like the the one in Hawaii in the early 70s. And all they had were all of his, not all of his bad movies, but, you know, some of his movies weren't too good. But that's all they had. This actually is sealed. And it costs $6.99 and it's a double CD. So like I said, you can get some really good deals at uh, Chumley's. I saw Black Sabbath. Sabotage and Sabbath Bloody Sabbath sealed and it's the newer remastered versions of, of them and they were like I think $6.99 This is the boring part of the video where taking plastic off the CD and you just sit there and, and say when is this guy going to start talking again? 
Nice picture of Elvis. Pictures. Very nice booklet. These, these uh, it's like a, a series, the Essential Velvet Underground. I saw one on them. They're very good. Like, if you don't want to, you know, collect everything by a, a certain artist, you just want their greatest stuff, then you can get the, the Essential Nickelback or the Essential Canadian Stud Muffin. He's caught in a trap there, you can tell. Let me see. That's all right, baby, let's play house, mystery train, heartbreak hotel. I was the one, blue suede shoes, hound dog, don't be cruel. Love me tender, all shook up. There'll be a There'll be peace in the valley for me, jailhouse rock, trouble, fever, it's now or never. Reconsider, baby. Are you lonesome tonight? Do you miss me tonight? Are you sorry we drifted apart? Don't sing. Okay. Uh, little sister. Follow that dream, can't help falling in love. That's only one CD. There's another CD. Return to Sender. You're the devil in disguise. I love that song. Bossa Nova Baby. Viva Las Vegas. Big Boss Man. A little less conversation. A little more action. <laughs> can't help it. If I can dream. Memories in the ghetto. Suspicious minds. Don't cry daddy. Kentucky rain. Polk Salad Annie, The Wonder of You, I Just Can't Help Believin', Burnin' Love, Always On My Mind, Stream, Stream Roller Blues, Hurt and Moody Blue. There's a song, it was a, I think it was like a compilation album in the early, in the early 70s. Uh, you know, when they would just release so many Elvis Presley albums. It was called Almost In Love. Anyway, I loved my sister had that, and I loved Almost in Love and Stay Away Joe. And I don't think Stay Away Joe is on, because I don't remember saying it. And the other one that isn't on here that I always liked, I remember having my sister having the 45 and the 60s, Guitar Man. I like that. And so, that's my unboxing for today. Thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. Happy Valentine's Day. Thank you. Thank you very much.